under pronation. It's the word used to describe what happens when a runner's foot does not roll inward enough when it hits the ground. The heel strikes first, the runner's weight transfers to the outside of the foot, and it stays there. So the runner pushes off the outer toes to begin the next stride. This video shows an underpronator running on a treadmill. Notice that her ankles aren't rolling inward at all. In slow motion, you can see that the sides of her feet are the first point of contact. There's little to no bend along the outside edge of her foot up to her lower leg. Her weight stays to the outside as she steps through the gait cycle. Underpronation is more common in runners who have high arches. Another way to tell if you're an underpronator is to check the bottom of an old pair of running shoes. If the wear marks are concentrated along the outside edges of the sole, there's a good chance that this is your running pattern. Underpronation is not a bad thing, but it does put added pressure on your lower legs that can lead to injury. To avoid this, runners who underpronate should seek out neutral running shoes with extra cushioning that will help absorb the force of impact.